Today we're in for a Lebanese treat. I'm with Chef Myrna at Yahala Restaurant, and we're gonna have stuffed eggplant, and um, a lot of people aren't really keen on eggplant, but this is really different and really good. So, how do you pronounce what we're making? We're making a stuffed eggplant dish. It's pronounced Sheikh El Mahshi. Okay. It's a little bit hard to pronounce it, but that's the name of the dish. Okay. We're gonna show the audience how to do it. Okay. You buy the Italian eggplant and you peel them, like a strips from the top to the bottom. Okay. You leave a line of the skin. Is that for a decorative purpose, or no, what are we doing that for? Uh, it's too much to eat the skin, and then a little bit of the skin will hold the eggplant together. Okay. And then uh, we'll do several ones, another one here, and then we will deep fry them. You can deep fry them at home. I'm gonna deep fry them here in my deep fryer. A little bit easier for you. Yes, and you give them a, a cut in the fat side of the eggplant. And that's for? So they cook faster. Okay. And then? Time to deep fry them here. And how long does that take? It takes like uh, maybe eight minutes to deep fry them. Okay. And they will be ready to stuff after that. Okay. And you want to turn them a little bit over so they can be red in all sides of the eggplant. So while the eggplant are frying, let's talk a little bit about what we're going to stuff it with. Yeah, we're going to stuff it with ground beef. It's uh, three-fourths of a pound of ground beef. Okay. Season with a little little salt. Two teaspoon of salt. One and a half of uh, allspice. So allspice is a secret ingredient. Yes, and half of black pepper. Okay. And then two tablespoons of olive oil. And they're ready to be cooked. You want to make sure they're cooked very well before you add the onion to it. Okay. It smells smells really good. And you have some ready right next to it. I have some ready, which I added uh, two cups of diced onion. And then the final touch is the pine nuts, three, four cup of pine nuts to it. And then it's ready to go to be inside the eggplant. So the eggplants are ready in their uh, baking pan. And then you open them with the spoon okay. and you get the stuffing here. You stuff it in the cavity of the eggplant and you fill it all the way to the top. Okay, I think I can do that. Let me give it you a try. You wanna try? Yeah, let me give it a try. But I don't wanna go all the way to the, uh, I don't wanna cut through, right? Yes. Okay. Very good. A little more or good? A little more. A little more, okay. Add that one. We'll get this one. Is that good? Very good. Okay, all right. One last one, one last one here. So then, so this is all done now. And so the next thing is gonna be? To do the sauce okay. of the eggplant. So it's uh, four, four, three cups of uh, beef broth, and then one cup of tomato puree, you mix them together and then they're ready to go in the baking tray. And that's just what it's gonna cook in. Yes, and then you place the sauce. And then this is gonna go in how hot of an oven? 350. Three, and how long is it gonna cook? 15 minutes. Okay, and great. And then it will be ready to go. All right, well, we'll get that in the oven and uh, when it's done, we'll bring it out. So Chef, this is the finished dish. How do you serve it here at the restaurant? We serve it with a side of uh, basmati rice. And then uh, you scoop the eggplant. It's beautiful. The stuffed eggplant into your plate with the sauce. I'd like to recommend everybody give this a try. Either come here to the restaurant or you can get the recipe at fusionnw.com. It really is wonderful. And even if you don't like eggplant, this is an eggplant that people are going to like, right? It's delicious. Right. Just, just one of the many wonderful things that you can have here at Yahala. Thanks for sharing the recipe. Thank you so much. Oh,